Read it out loud. Tornadoes. A tornado is defined as following, of, as follows. A twisting column of air extending from a thunderstorm to the ground. The formation of a tornado depends on the airflow pattern of the storm. If the airflow pattern is one of the is one of spiraling winds, it could spin water vapor into a funnel shape or vortex. As the vortex spins down to the ground, it picks up debris and therefore becomes more visible. Not all storms have the right conditions to produce a tornado. Supercells, which are severe storms with high concent concentrations of energy, cause most tornadoes. Supercells are most likely to form in areas where winds are coming from different directions at many levels. A large supercell can cause problems in a few ways. It can create tornadoes that last for several days as well as create two or more tornadoes simultaneously. The force, of a tor the force of tornado winds can cause a long path of damage more than one mile wide and 50 miles long. This tornado, these tornado winds, which can carry huge objects for miles, are the strongest winds on earth. For example, Strong tornado winds from Oklahoma once carried a motel sign, motel sign 30 miles and then dropped it in Arkansas. Even cars, trees, and entire houses have been lifted off the ground from the force of tornadoes. Scientists who study tornadoes rely on radar to, to provide data about the storms across the country. Uh, uh, to provide data about the storms across the country, scientists from the National Weather Service are installing. Doppler radio, radi radars that can detect air movement. By detecting increasing air movement during a storm, scientists will have more time to issue warnings before a tornado forms. When a tornado warning is issued in an area, many homes and schools already have safety plans prepared. As a rule, these safety plans include moving to a protected underground shelter like a basement. It is a good idea for families and schools to practice their safety plans regularly so we so each person knows what to do in the unlikely event that a tornado approaches. Thank you.